Nemso Indian Defense, Classical, Zurich Variation, 5.NF3D66.BD2. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. Opening with the queen's pawn. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. By taking control of the crucial d5 square and creating a space on which the knight can move to c3 without obstructing the c-pawn, move c4 helps to create a strong center. The move e6 creates a line for the dark squared bishop, sets up a rapid castle, and prepares to push a pawn to d5 and recover the piece if it is taken. And c3 develops the knight to fight for the e4 square and to control d5. In the Nimso Indian defense, bb4 pins the knight on c3, preventing it from moving or protecting e4, and threatens to trade, disrupting white's pawns after bx c3. qc2 defends the knight on c3 and continues the fight for the e4 square. The pawn on d4 is attacked, the knight moves toward the center, and the e5 square is under the control of nc6. nf3 develops the knight toward the center and supports the d4 pawn. d6 controls the e5 and c5 squares and opens up the d7 square. bd2 develops the bishop toward the center, breaks the pin on the c3 knight and prepares to castle. It is the last book move. This ignores an opportunity to strike at the center with a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This strikes the opponent's bishop. That's good. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. The game was close to balanced, but now black is worse. It is an inaccuracy. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. That's good. This strikes at the center, countering the opponent's ability to grab space. This threatens to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is best. This strikes a rival knight. It is ideal. The knight is thus brought to safety. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. This misses an opportunity to develop a rook off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is ideal. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is best. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. That's good. This allows the knight to control more squares. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is best. This reveals an attack that poses a threat to a rook. It is ideal. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only move that works. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is good. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is best. This misses an opportunity to increase a bishop's scope by moving it to a better square. It is an inaccuracy. The knight can now control more squares as a result. That's good. This misses a chance to advance a rook from its starting square. It is incorrect. That's fine. It is good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This prevents the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is good. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is best. The best choice is this one. 
It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. This turns the pawn into a passed pawn, which means no other pawn may oppose it as it advances. It is quite good. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This threatens to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is best. This threatens to win a rook. This stops the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a bishop. It is excellent. There was just one smart move to be made. It is incorrect. This shields the knight who was attacked. It is ideal. As a result, the bishop may now control more squares because it is in a better position. It is ideal. This poses a threat to an open file and a rook. That's good. This misses a chance to improve a bishop's square and broaden its range. It is incorrect. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is ideal. This avoids the queen's check. It is ideal. There was only one good move in that position. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a pawn. It is a mistake. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. Backs off. White is equal at this point in the end game. It is ideal. Now that the rook is on an open file, it is easier to control squares all over the board. It is ideal. That's fine. It is good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. This threatens to reveal an attack on a pawn. It is excellent. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This reveals an attack on a pawn. It is best. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This reveals an assault and puts a pawn in danger. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This prevents the opponent from being able to create a passed pawn. It is best. Recaptures. It is ideal. The bishop is now on a square that is more secure. It is quite good. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is quite good. This places a rook on the seventh rank, activating it and putting the other side's king under pressure. It is quite good. This pins a bishop and increases pressure. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This moves the checking rook farther away. It is ideal. The bishop is now on a square that is more secure. It is quite good. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. By moving it from the back rank, this activates the king in the end game. It is quite good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. A solid choice. It is excellent. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Both players had incredible precision in the end game.